Okay, grade twos, activity 71 is fractions again. It's this one. Okay, teacher's not going to show you on the board again because I think you should remember from what we did yesterday what to do here. Okay, so I'm just going to read to you. Okay, an object divided into three equal parts is divided into thirds. Okay, I'll maybe show you that because yesterday we did quarters. So thirds is when they take one shape and they divide it into three equal parts. Okay, one, two, three. So that is called thirds. Okay, remember yesterday the shape was divided into four parts, that was quarters. It was divided into two parts, it's half. So yeah, they divided it into three parts. So that is called thirds. Okay, so they are going to give you shapes that are divided into thirds and they're going to tell you how many thirds to colour in. So if they give you two thirds, it means you colour in one, two. Okay, if they say colour in one third, it means you're going to colour in only one. Okay, if they say colour in one whole, okay, if they say colour in one whole, it means you colour in the whole shape. One, two, three. So three thirds is equal to one whole. So whether they say colour in three thirds or if they say colour in one whole, it means the same thing. Okay, that means you colour in all three pieces. Okay, then at the bottom, they gave you six, six rectangles that are all divided into five parts. If a shape is divided into five parts, it's called a fin. Okay, it's called fin. Okay, then... They ask you again to colour in two fifths or three fifths or four fifths. Okay? If they ask you to colour in two fifths, it means you colour in two blocks. Okay? If it's four fifths, you colour in four blocks. Five fifths, you colour in five blocks. One whole means it's the whole shape again. So then it's five fifths. It's the same as one whole. Okay? So that was for activity. 71k in your workbook. Okay. Let's go to activity 72. See you now.